Hey Bellas! Welcome to my channel and for today's episode we are going to have a lot of talk about beauty pageants and today we are going to talk about the recently concluded Miss Earth 2020 and of course the winner is none other than from Miss USA. She is the newly crowned Miss Earth 2020. So I am doing this video to congratulate Miss USA for a job well done to secure the title for the first time. So this is history. The winner of Miss Earth 2020 is Lindsay Marie Coffey from the United States. She is the first ever Miss USA to be crowned as Miss Earth. They've been runner-ups before, but this time they got the title finally. And they inherited the crown to the winner from Puerto Rico as the Miss Earth 2019 winner. So, what can we say about Lindsay Coffee or Lindsay Marie Coffee? She is 28 years old and Actually, she's very tall. She's 5'9 inches tall. She graduated with a degree on political science and communication and arts. And she is a vegetarian, as I have learned. And that's why I look at her. She has this petite and gorgeous body. And her skin is flawless. You know, I have seen many vegetarians. They are all flawless because, of, you know, they eat healthy foods, right? organics, and things like that. And this is a major victory to the Miss Earth USA organization because for the first time, they bagged the title of Miss Earth 2020. She totally deserved the crown because I am so impressed with her performance. You know, not to mention she is a full-time model and the girl loves to travel a lot. She goes to Zimbabwe as much as she can. She go to the jungle. I, sh I don't know what, what's in the jungle, but she loves the jungle, the nature. I totally agree that she deserve the crown. I don't know why there are still people who will complain, just like any other pageants, international, local pageants, at the end of the at the end somebody has to complain and i don't know why this trend is going on from miss universe philippines miss colombia you know miss earth well there is this miss thailand who doesn't like the outcome or the result of the pageant she told everyone that she doesn't just deserve to be in the top 20. She deserved more than top 20. She she needs to be in the second stage of the competition. But come on, guys. When you are competing, you cannot just go out there and think that you can 100% make it. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. Because this is like a sports. Everybody can lose a pageant. Sometimes the outcome is not the way we wanted to. But we need to accept that. Even though you work so hard to get the crown, at the end of the day, the result is the result. You cannot complain about it. Because sometimes it is the prerogative of the judges of every organization, every pageants in the world to choose their own winner who would represent the organization. And if you are not the type of girl that they doesn't choose to be the winner of this competition, you should not feel bad about it. You shouldn't be bitter about it. There are things that we can never achieve in life, even though you work hard on something. And sometimes you will face failure, you will face rejection, but that doesn't mean that you are a lesser person. Huwag kang sasali kung hindi mo kayang tanggapin ang resulta sa isang kompetisyon. Because pageants is like a sports. You doesn't know who's gonna win, just like a grand slam in tennis. Do you think that Federer, Djokovic, or Rafael Nadal can win? 
all the time? Of course not. He doesn't know that they practice a lot, 100%. It's about destiny. And if, that, if the star doesn't align with you, what can we do? Even maglupasay ka pa dyan. Even we, we fight with the organizer. Even we uh, press charges. But if you press charges, make sure that you have, the, you have to back up with, with evidence. You know, you cannot just make a statement without an evidence. Okay? There are deserving winners of Miss Earth 2020. Walang nangyaring dayaan. Walang nangyaring cooking. Huwag ka nang sumali kung ayaw mong matalo. Yun lang yun. It's easy as that. Do not join a competition if you think you cannot handle the result of losing. Joining a competition is a risk. Is it, it is a challenge to you. That's why it is a competition. All those beautiful winners. We have Miss Earth Fire. If I'm not mistaken, she's from Denmark, right? Miss Earth Water from Philippines. And Miss Earth Air from Venezuela. And, and of course, Miss Earth 2020 from USA. Come on. And I hope that no one should underestimate or question the countries who made it to the top. So anyway, guys, hopefully you like this video. And if you agree, or maybe you will disagree on what I say about if Lindsay Coffee and other elemental courts were deserving to be a winner, it's up to you to, to judge. And in my, in my thoughts and in my views, I totally think that they deserve it and for those who complain just join another pageants maybe you can rise above and if you think you're beautiful enough just keep on joining stop negativity we love every girls around the world so please stop negativity and let's support the winner okay so if you're still not part of the team Bella's channel please do subscribe on my channel. You don't want to miss all my videos. And hit that notification bell so you will be notified in all of my videos. See you guys. Bye!